legitimate claim to stay in this country because of concerns he has about being returned to his native Ethiopia uh, and what kind of security threat she believes this man may pose uh, to this country. All of that will have to be weighed up by the Home Secretary before she then decides on his status here. But it is uh, likely, we're told, that he won't be held uh, in custody, that he will be released, but he may be subject to some kind of uh, conditions. That, of course, uh, we don't know what they uh, would be at this stage. The first pictures of Binyam Mohamed disembarking from that aircraft, which stopped en route in Bermuda on its way from Cuba. We've slightly enhanced those pictures to give you a slightly closer view of him getting off that aircraft, looking uh, perhaps because of that flight, but perhaps because of the hunger strike that he's been on for the past few days and weeks. A fairly stooped figure accompanied by officials alongside him there. Our thanks to Mark White at Northolt, our Home Affairs correspondent, and Tim Marshall for his commentary as well, our Foreign Affairs editor.